Family State camera right now. Uh, we can see uh, some clouds that are a little more intense, a little thinning in the clouds out there, uh, but uh, not a, as stormy as perhaps you might think. 52 degrees the current temperature that we have there uh, from the Stoller Family State in Dayton. Let's uh, take a look right now at the radar because we're watching these showers that were pretty heavy and widespread in the Portland area a few hours earlier this morning. Now it's pushing its way towards the north and to the east, so it's, we're starting to see it dissipate a little bit, but still some showers, especially to the south of Portland along I-5 and then if you're into the gorge or the foothills of the Cascades, pretty rainy out there and some of that's a little bit heavy. You can see that uh, dark green and yellow indicating that. But uh, west side metro, you're in pretty good shape right now with just some wet roads out there, but not a lot of rain overhead. 50s everywhere across the metropolitan area, right at 50 in Vernonia, 56 Trotdale, 52 in Happy Valley, 55 Milwaukee, 56 Vancouver as well as PDX. So here's the cloud rain forecast map. By 7 o'clock, I think most of those showers will continue to move their way on over to the east, probably still dropping off some rain in the gorge as well as the foothills of the Cascades, but pretty cloudy skies for most of the state at that point in time. We get to the afternoon, we'll see some of those showers really start to develop over to central and eastern Oregon. Could produce some isolated thunderstorms. We'll see just very cloudy skies, but not a whole lot of rain here as we go through the day, but still under the gun for at least a few little scattered showers. By 10 o'clock tonight, might even have a little clearing there over the Portland area, uh, but still the rain falling over the northeast corner of the state. Now, we get to Saturday morning. 5 o'clock, we'll have the uh, leading edge of a very rainy day that will be with us through the day into the afternoon. Some of those rain showers could be heavy at times, and then we'll continue into the 9 o'clock hour uh, by Saturday night. And then we get into Sunday, still looking at several more showers through the day, but just not as steady as what we'll have on Saturday. So today, only getting about another 3 hundredths of an inch of rain out there, uh, getting closer to a third of an inch in Bonneville and Welch's. But then once we add Saturday in, then we're up to about 8 tenths of an inch in Portland and well over an inch in Tillamook and Newport. But then as we take it through the rest of the day on Sunday. That's when we will go over that one inch mark there here in the Portland area. An inch and a quarter down in Salem, so even more down there. Look at Welch's. They'll get about 1.71 inches of rain in that amount of time between now and the end of the day on Sunday. So 66 with a couple of showers still lingering today. The very rainy, somewhat windy day Saturday up to 60. 60 with showers on Sunday. We get to Monday. We will see a mostly dry day up to 65. 77 partly cloudy. 83 and mostly sunny by Wednesday. Then Thursday, another chance for showers and a high of 75. Tony? Yeah.